Welcome back to Morgantown, West Virginia. Our continuing coverage of wild and wonderful West Virginia athletics here on Root Sports. The Mountaineers leading the Georgia State Panthers 17 to nothing at the half. Not the only Big 12 team in action today. Let's take a look at the schedule and the scores. Of course, on Thursday night it was Texas Tech defeating TCU by the score of 20 to 10. Oklahoma leading Tulsa that game in the third, 27 to 7. The score there. Iowa and Iowa State, Kansas and Rice. Mississippi and Texas, UMass, Kansas State, Lamar, Oklahoma State, all coming up later. Blake Bell having a great game right now for Oklahoma. As you can see, he last week came into that game for Oklahoma starting quarterback and kind of took over the reins and ran that offense. Well, we were talking to Dana Holgerson about that and said, you know, really, each team's similar. I mean, they lose... Uh, quarterback drafted by the Pittsburgh Steelers in the fourth round. Landry, of course, uh, we know about the West Virginia guys that moved on to the NFL ranks. Geno Smith, Stedman Bailey, Tavon Austin. So each team replacing not only their quarterbacks, but their wide receivers. So kind of the, the type of game they expected. And West Virginia just didn't get the plays down the stretch from Paul Millard they were looking for. And that's why Ford Childress is in this game today for the Mountaineers. Exactly right. West Virginia showing those inconsistencies, you know. Big play here, comeback, so 